first class uh, lounge uh, British Airways here in Gatwick. Uh, just keep in mind that the lounge closes at 7 o'clock. So you need to be a little bit fast if you want to order any food or any drinks. Uh, but after that you can move in the business class uh, lounge. But that's not the same. Tonight we had a surprise. Uh, by some uh, glitch, uh, because of a glitch in the system, uh, my order arrived a little bit later than expected. But Christos, uh, one of the gentlemen working here in First Class Lounge, came and said, we just got your ticket, we are cooking your food. I said, yeah, but you'll close the lounge. He said, no worries, we'll bang fingers around, but you can enjoy your dinner. That's a very, very good customer service. Thank you, Christos. Paracalo. That week it's working very, very hard to keep its reputation. Uh, they start boarding in time, uh, in groups, and after that everybody is scrumped in the same room, one on top of the other. And after that, in the plane, Iberia Express will ask you to wear a mask. Safety first, health first, pointless first. Finally, I arrived in Madrid. It was a very long flight from Gatwick to Madrid, two hours, 10 minutes. Uh, normally it's one hour 50, one hour 55, but it was quite long. And we left Gatwick with uh, a slight the delay. Uh, what can I say about Iberia Express? Uh, from uh, the business uh, point of view, Iberia Express is the low cost version of Iberia, which means must be low-cost version of uh, British Airways but the service both uh, hard and soft product far much better than British Airways the service was uh, flawless so nice so polite so so customer service oriented even the food was far much better 
that what British Airways offer in the same flight from London to Madrid in Club Europe. But at the end of the day, I'm in Madrid and I'm waiting for my suitcases. Mm -hmm.